Morning, police are still searching for the person who hit a teenager at an Edina bus stop. She's expected to be physically okay, but certainly what happened here has left the entire community with a lot of questions and concerns. Katie Steiner, live this morning from where this happened, early Thursday, right around, well, not too, too far from this time of morning, Katie. Yeah, absolutely, Jason. And now that 17 year old, she is home from the hospital. She's recovering with her family and her family tells us that she is walking around, but obviously still in a lot of pain this morning. Happened here in Edina at France and Halifax. That's where we are right now. And Kayla Avant, she was getting ready to get on to that school bus when she got hit by a car. Police said that the driver went around the school bus that was at her bus stop and then hit her and drove off. And officers think that the driver Driver did see the flashing lights that were on and that bus stop arm that was out. Police have a photo of the car that they're looking for. So here's a closer look at that. They say it's a black Chevy Malibu or a Chevy Cruze. And Kyla's grandma was begging anyone who the person that was driving that car to turn themselves into police. If you have a conscience or a heart, think about it. You just left my grandchild there. You hit her and you left. You didn't even check on her. Now, if you know anything about this case, if you recognize the car, if you know maybe who was driving that car, please call 952-826-1600. Jason? You'd think there'd be a little damage or something, but somebody with a conscience. Boy, that grandmother said it right. Katie Steiner, thank you.